All right, in the last video, we finished up more of the state machine and got it so that the character is jumping and falling and knows when it's jumping and falling. It got all this information about it right here. You know, it controls it all. So it knows now if we're jumping, when we're falling, when we're hitting the ground, when we should idle. Problem is we don't have animations that go with this stuff, despite the fact that this code right here is telling the animator, oh, we're actually in the jumping state now. We're in number, what number is that? Three. Or, or number two or we're number three for the falling state it tells the animator that the animator should be updating that the problem is it doesn't have that right now it doesn't have access to that it doesn't know it it doesn't have a jumping and a falling animation so we're going to start this off with a challenge because uh we've gone over this before i want you to set up a jump animation and a falling animation on here and i want you to connect them to both the run and the idle over here and you can make it so that this thing can actually run that all right so let's go over to the character let's uh go back into this area right here we can see that, that we got a jump you see inside the jump over here there's no fall animation you're like oh alvin what did you do if you click on both these pictures sir they each have their own on over here here's the jump one here's the fall one and you're like, oh, they're only one picture a piece. Can I just put them in there? No, you still got to make an animation for each one of them. So we go create animation, jump, create animation, animation. Still looking for it. There we go. I'm the type of guy that can't find the ketchup inside of the fridge, by the way, when it's right there in front of my face. Okay, jump and fall. We're going to go over here, drag them right in. Ta -da. You could also drag them over to the player. It does the same exact thing. Some of you might use that method because it's what we've used in the past. That's okay. We want to transition from both run and idle to jump. Remember, you want to uncheck this. You got three things to do. Uncheck that, undo that, hit that to zero. Same thing over here. Uncheck that, uncheck that, zero. All right, so now these both work. You want this to be a state and you want it to say equals. And you want this to say one, no, two, sorry. And same thing on this one right here, exact same reason, equals two. So when we're running, if the state is equivalent to two, it'll go to jump. And idle, if it's equivalent to running, I mean jumping, you'll go to jump as well. Two, jump, right? Now from jump, you're gonna go backwards, uncheck, uncheck, zero. You're going to want it to be able to go back to running. Mm, we probably won't need this, but I like to build it in just in case. If it's equivalent to one, make transition, uncheck, uncheck, zero. And you want this to be equivalent to zero. Okay, so now we can do all this. Now, the only thing that's going to be using the falling animation is this one right here now you probably won't ever need these two transitions back i just build them in just in case you never know when something might get stuck or something happens too fast and the game doesn't update right you just want to build it in so you want to have this state and this is equivalent to three this is the third one remember it goes zero one two three <coughs> and now we have the fall animation getting set now this only goes back to idle and I'm not going to really worry about the run portion of this because there's always a going from idle to run. So it's going to be equivalent to zero. So you see here, it goes equivalent to three, equivalent to zero. All right. Now at this point, you can see there's no animation connected to it. So that's creating a problem. And now it's not even, oh, it did go back to idle. Did I forget to do something? I probably did. Yeah. Uncheck. See, that's, you see that long pause between there? That's all because of that. So where he just kind of stood still when he was on the ground. I was like, why is he not like going back to idle? So over here, he goes to jump. He just pauses because there's no animation. Pauses because there's no animation. All right. So now we want to go window. We want to go to animation, animation. If you did not do the challenge earlier and you didn't handle this yourself, then please try to take the challenge right now and set up the animations for both fall and jump. All right, click on player, you go in here, you go to jump, you just drag this right in there, and all of a sudden we have a jump animation going, we hit play, you'll just see him running, you're like, why is he so tiny? It's the same reason that it always is, hit 16 pixels on there, apply that, and then we're going to go to fall, and you just drag this one into here as well, 
hit play to take it, check it out, and it looks good. We can exit out of that. We hit the play button one more time to test all our workouts. We are on the ground. Woo! And we jump, and then we fall. We jump, fall, idle. Jump, fall, idle. Well, it would idle if I didn't move right away. You can move left or right on there, and what do you know? It turns back and forth. We are looking somewhat good now. We have a lot of stuff going on. And so now we have set up jumping and falling animations. I believe we are good to go. Please just give me a like if you like this video. You can also subscribe and hit the bell notification and you will get the updates. Know when I am releasing more and more and more free tutorials just like this. Most importantly though, far more important than everything else I've said, please leave a comment below telling me what you would like to see next inside my next tutorial series, leaving me some feedback. I want to do this for a long, long time, people. I'm working on my craft right now. So like, I would like to do this better and better and better. I would like to improve myself, so please just give me some feedback. I would love it. Thank you. Have a great day.